Hey, good morning, y'all. So it's Candace Janae. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today is photo shoot day. Hey YouTube, it's Candace Janae. I'm a Christian entrepreneur, author, and speaker. I spend my time traveling, spending time with family, and creating content. I love helping women build profitable businesses. So welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm doing fall photo content and it's gonna be great, but I have to go to the gym, so that's literally where we're starting at. About to go to my gym over here, and then in just a second, I am going to be ripping and running until it's photo shoot time. So come with me. All right, guys, so I made it to Target, but it looks like I'm a little bit early, but I'm gonna go in here to grab some props and things that I forgot to grab, partially because I have a new apartment. I don't, you know, like I got rid of a lot of stuff. And so I'm going in here to grab like things like a mug and just little small decor pieces that can kind of enhance some of the shots and will serve as props for what I'm doing. So come along as soon as they open up these doors, we in here. All right, so we made it in and y'all know Target always has this like, you know, value section at the very front of the store. And I honestly really like these little fake plants. I know some people hate fake plants, but I love fake plants and they're only three dollars so I'm gonna grab some of these just to see how I can make use of them. Now we are on to the home section which I'm really excited about. I saw these trays yesterday and I was debating whether or not I should get them because I have like a marble table. They're very sturdy and heavy duty. They're by Project 62 but I'm gonna get this because I think this will be cute to put like my products on that I like want to showcase so I'm gonna grab one of these oh this is heavy oh my god it's so heavy nice and sturdy I also found these little cute plants I'm not fully certain how I'm gonna use them, but I really like the foliage on here. I think we see a trend here, and this is only $15, baby. It's going in the cart. It's going in the cart. Yeah, I'm a little clumsy sometimes. I think I'm gonna grab two of these because I feel like I can use them in multiple places. I mean, I could always move stuff around, but I just wanna have the ability to put stuff where I feel like it should go. I'm trying to decide if I want this. I feel like this is a good, like, bathroom prop. But my bathroom is chrome, and I feel like that would throw it off. <sighs> well, anywho, I'm gonna keep looking. I would really like a plant that's a little bit taller. Like, I've seen these things. This would be nice if it were fully green. Uh, I like this, it just doesn't go with the aesthetic of my home and like decor. I need a mug, so I'm gonna grab this for two bucks. It's gonna be a cute little prop. Y'all are gonna see how this all comes together. All right, so I made it back from Target and last night I spent some time kind of mapping out my different outfits. And what I did was I hung the earrings with them, the accessories, and generally the shoes, I kind of know what I've got going on, but I line them up this way and I do them in according, like I group them according to the location. So all of these I want to shoot in the same location. And then all of these I'd like to shoot in the same location to this group. This I'm gonna do outside because it's a coat, but this top, y'all. First of all, this skirt is from Red Dolls and it's so cute on. And then this top is also from them, it's super cute. Actually, this whole entire like look is from them. Um, and then I've got a cozy casual. Y'all see my wigs resting back there. Yeah, just leave them alone. But there you go. And I got lots of cute options and I think I can do a few more outfits than this, but I'm gonna start with this. All right, y'all, so now it's time for me to do my makeup and I brought my ring light into the bathroom. I also have some brand 
content that I'm gonna be shooting. So I've kind of arranged this the way that I want. Um, you guys can't really see the lighting that well because the light is blurring, but beauty marked lashes are the lashes I'm gonna be wearing. So you see that here. And then I also placed this stuff over here. Um, this right here, which is going to be what my photographer uses to kind of make me look good, make it look like a set. I'm gonna sit on the bathroom tub and, you know, showcase myself. And then I'm also, I have this here because I'm using this as a prop. You can't really see it that well, but it's Method Daily Shower Cleaner. If you're not already using it, you should definitely use it. It's like, it makes cleaning the shower easy. You basically get out the shower or tub, spray it down and keep it walk moving. So it's like daily cleaning. And then, you know, you can do a deep clean on weekends or twice a week, whenever you want. So, anywho, this is me getting ready to do my makeup. All right, so let's get to it. These are the additional items that I'm setting up as props. So I actually really love this Starbucks blonde roast it's like iced coffee cold and then this non-dairy almond milk and oat milk it's so good um so i'm gonna do content with that i've got my la marca prosecco my method all-purpose cleaner and then i've got um i've got green chef and i've got um some of the items that i'm gonna use from green chef over here so i'm like just prepping things so that once my photographer gets here, all I'll have to do is look cute. And then this is my little office workspace. Um, I'm using it to prop up all of my purses um, that I'm gonna be using in the shoot today. So if you haven't already, this is a black owned company, Andy, very amazing. I've got my Louis Vuitton, I got my YSL, and I have another black YSL that I need to pull out. So y'all, I'm running late. I need to quit playing and filming and actually get my makeup done. So this is Asia. She's my photographer. We're about to get these content photo shoots. Listen, together yeah. in this bathroom. So it's go time. Hey, we're on to our next location on the rooftop. <laughs> So one of the reasons why I even got this apartment was because it had an amazing space where I could literally easily access. And when you see it, y'all, it's so beautiful up here. It has really great decor. And for me, I take a lot of photo shoots and typically I would have had to rent an Airbnb or find a space that made sense for me. But it was really great in this place because I can easily access just by going upstairs in my building. And I really, really like that because the photos ended up turning out really great. Me trying to switch my hair in between shots without a mirror. I'm gonna try to tie this. You like this? Mm-hmm. That's cute. Okay. It's a look. All right, as you can see, I absolutely love being in front of the camera. And so I'm gonna share with you guys some tips for just posing better, showing up better on camera and planning for content days. So my tip number one is to practice in the mirror to figure out what angles you look good at. There's so many different things that you can do like tilting your head or you know, repositioning uh, your body in different ways or placing your hands in certain places. Um, and so you learn what looks good on you by practicing in the mirror. Number two is to smile and be serious. So you see I'm smiling here, but sometimes I like to switch it up and have my little serious face going on. And that is something that really helps kind of give some versatility to my photos. Number three is to plan ahead and with your content and in your location. So a lot of times I like to send the pictures of the location ahead of time to the photographer. And I also like to get kind of like either a Pinterest board that gives me inspiration for the photo shoot. And that also gives me ideas of how to um, 
how to pose in my photos as well. Um, number four is to make sure you get with the photographer that you really vibe with. I really love working with Asia. Um, she and I get along really well. Our personalities go well together. And so it really helps with the photo shoot. Number five is to learn how to do hair and makeup. Okay. Like I did my own makeup and of course I didn't do anything special to my hair. Um, but it really helps to make sure that you have that in place. And you guys can see these photos turned out literally so, 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 so great. Um, I am not mad at them because baby, look at me, I'm looking so cute. All right, y'all, it's a wrap for photo shoot day and I'm filming on both sides. So it's a wrap! It was a wrap. Ooh, good. Listen, we got through maybe like almost 10, no. a lot of outfits in three hours. We did. And we encountered a little bit of trouble. We did, but we still made it on time. So we made it on time and we good, so. Exactly. Bye, y'all. As always, thank you for watching my YouTube channel. Make sure that you subscribe and get into these next videos. I always appreciate the comments, the love, and make sure when you subscribe, you comment and let me know so I can welcome you.